This is how you cope a corner. So what you want to do is take your saw, put it to 45. So let's say you want these two pieces to join right here, and you want this one to be the cope piece which sits on top. What you're going to want is to make sure the long side of your cut is on the inside. So let's say you cut on an angle here. This is the long side. You want that on the inside of your wall. Once you got your saw set to 45, you cut it. Now that you got the angle of it cut out, you're going to want to cut the inside out of it. As long as you cut it probably 90 degrees from the, the facing side, you'll be fine. But try to cut it a little more inwards, so then you have some wiggle room to hinge it. Once you got the rough shape in with the grinder, you can go along with the rasp and smooth it out. I find an angle grinder works best for getting most of it off, but then once you go with the file, it's all smooth. And for the moment of truth, there you see the cope holds a perfect angle right there in the corner, especially on this old house I'm working on right now. Uh, if the walls aren't square, it works relatively well without having to measure an angle.